I'm Wolf Photo. I'm your... I'm Will Photo. I'm your kitchens, countertops, 4x4 plexi display cubes favorite photographer. So if you've already forgotten, please go hit the like button. We will continue with the video shortly. And we're back. Alrighty, today's video is about book bags. Book bags? What the fuck is a book bag? Well, a book bag goes on your back. Like this. This is a book bag. You use that when you go to school. Like this. You put books in them. Like these. Um, okay. You know what a book bag is. This is the book bag I've been using for quite some time now. I'm gonna do a similar video to the one I did almost exactly a year ago today. It's what's in my camera bag. And this one, there's nothing. Uh, Cause I'm done using this book bag for now. I got a new book bag to show you. So the book bag I'm about to show you, I've had for a while. I just kind of go back and forth with using it. When I had my old gear, when I got it, I had a Nikon D7000 and I had like three different lenses and it fit it all really nicely, but it was also too complicated to like fit everything appropriately. Well now I've upgraded my camera a while ago and I have the Sony a7 II, which I'm shooting on right now, so I can't show it to you. But I will take a video so you can see what it looks like right now. Um, and I'm actually going to make this video um, for TikTok. So let me get the bag. I fucked that up. Yo, TikTok. I'm actually filming a video for YouTube right now. But I told them that I would show them the camera with my iPhone. So I figured, why not make a TikTok? So the video I'm filming is what's in my camera bag and my camera bag in general. Here's the camera for you YouTube viewers. Um, yeah, this is what I shoot on on a daily basis. Simple, basic, and to the point. So I'm making a video that's gonna come out Friday of this camera bag, how it works. It's very cool, it's very in-depth, and you should go check it out. Yo, TikTok, we'll check it. So now that that's over, and you know the camera that I use, and the camera that would normally be in this bag, we can move on from all of that. So this is the camera bag that I got. Um, it's a lower pro. This bag is sick and I'm actually really stoked to be using it again because it's actually like perfect for photographers. And in no way is this video sponsored or anything. It's 10 times better than the bag I was using. I just like to switch back and forth, but we're back. Looks like a normal backpack. Well, I'm gonna show you how you set it up, what I have inside of it and exactly how it works. So really cool thing. You can open it up from the back. So you grab the zipper and it opens up like this. I have no idea if this angle is good or not, but we're filming the whole video like this so you can see it and you can look at me too because I know you really want to look at me. So the book bag is usually the other way around, but this is fine. Upside down, good times. These little slots right here that are dividing it all up, they actually move around. They're Velcro, so you can hear it ready. So you can customize this exactly how you want and make it as functional as possible. So I've decided to separate it into three compartments. I have this one where my camera goes, it lays down right here, very easy to grab. And you're going to see why I set it up the way I did very shortly. So my camera goes in this spot, right here is charger cables, I have my camera strap. And then in here are my chargers. It's kind of set up funny, but you're going to see why it's set up like that in a second. So the chargers go in there. And then right here I have this divided off and this carries my tripod for vlogging. Now, the camera bag gets cooler. Aside from all this stuff, it has a compartment up here. It has three zipper pockets, which I don't have much. Ah, oh, this is broken. Hold on, I need to fix this. Please hold one moment while I retie this. Now that that's done, okay, so this, this bag is meant for a lot of shit. You can also put a fucking laptop in here. What more could you possibly need, right? Bag opens like this. This is how it opens, right? So that's how you set it up. Now I'm gonna close it. Right? So the bag's looking really good on my back and it's got like a hard material so it doesn't, you can, you can hit it on stuff. So up here, we have this. This unzips and it opens like this and you can see right in there is where my camera would be. Easy access, just reach in and grab it. It's right there. And you open this compartment, nothing else is coming out of here. The camera is, what? Well, the camera would come out of here, 
but you're assuming you already took it out and all the other stuff in here, it's not coming out. Top part, camera compartment. Zip that bad boy back up. We go to this side and you have this compartment right here that unzips and opens up. And what do you know? Like I said before, tripod comes out, nothing else in this bag is coming out. Makes it easy to get certain things if you know where they are. Now, you're like, oh, Will, how do you know, how do you know what side that's on? Right, because the other side has stuff in it too. Well, see, I've marked that with this pen. So now when I'm out in a photo shoot and I need a fucking pen, uh, there's a pen right here. This is the side that basically carries my batteries. So this represents the side that carries my batteries. Batteries, right here. Easy, they come right out. Right in this little slidey compartment. That's pretty sick if you ask me. You got the battery chargers and my camera strap. And it's all locked, all packed, nice and tight. All right, now for one of the coolest parts, I think, of this book bag that you wouldn't know unless I showed you. You're out in the rain. You don't want all your gear to get wet. Right here on the bottom, this bad boy pulls out. And now your bag and all of your gear are covered from the elements. Talking about the main thing in my bag, which is my camera. That's the thing that I want to protect the most, and that bag makes it very easy to do. That's what's in my camera bag part two. Oh, also, wait, before, I'm not done yet. What do you guys think of this new camera angle? I was filming off of my desk, but it was hard to get it like matched up every time, so I got a permanent tripod set up right there. I got the two lights coming in. I also did change this light too because it was the other one was very bright and I wanted one to help display this work better. That's what's new here. I'll just be grinding. You can check me out on Instagram at will.pullman. You can check out my YouTube. That You should subscribe to my YouTube. Also, you can check me out on TikTok, Will Pullman. I post a lot of like behind the scenes stuff. I answer people's questions on there. I hope to see you there. Enjoy your day. Um, I'll see you next Friday.